Welcome, this is the Delta Math tutorial simplifying nth root of radical type 1. It asks us to simplify the third root because that's 3 here, 8x to the 9. Understand that this implies a 3 root here, implies it's to the 1 third power. Okay? So that's all I'm going to do. I'm going to write 8 to the one third power and I have x to the then I have x to the ninth and the uh, and the cube root here is going to be divided by three so now I can do this in my calculator eight to the one third power should be two let me just double check that that is correct. And then this can be 9 divided by 3. It's just 3. So the final answer is 3 is 2x to the power of 3. And that is correct. And here are all the steps. Now we have 3 root of 8x to the 21. Again, the if it's the cube root, the exponent here is divided is to one third. So you divide by three. So it's 8 to the one third power x to the 21 divided by three. So 8 to the 1 third is just 2. x 21 divided by 3 is to the 7. So the answer is 2x to the 7th power. And there you go. Now it's to the 4th. So that means if it's 4 radical, that means it's to the power of one fourth. Okay. So we have the fourth root of eighty one x to the fortieth. So eighty one, the exponent is one fourth. Then we have x forty. Then divide this by four. So eighty one to the one fourth power is 3 and x 40 divided by 4 is just 10 so it is 3x to the 10th power there you go let's do one more pro problem this is an easy one so I can still do it if you would like if you don't see the number there's really a 2 here so the, squ the square root is just to the one half power. So we take 36 to the one half and we have x squared and that's going to be divided by 2. Right? 36 to the one half is just 6. x to divide by 2 is just x. So the answer is 6x. Submit. There you go. And let's do the last one. We have the cube root of 64 x to the 6. This is the cube root. So this is going to be equal to the 1 third power. So the exponent is 1 divided by 3. So we have 64 to the 1 third because that's what the radical 3 is. Then we have x6, and then we have to divide by 3, because that's what the radical is. If you plug that into your calculator, 64 to the 1 third power is 4, and x6 divided by 3 is just 2. So the answer is 4x to the 
to the second power. There you go. All right, that is your simplifying and through radical type one.